And out of that star studded concert featuring Elton John, Mariah Carey and more coming together from the comfort of their own homes, raising more than a million dollars for first responders and those in need. TJ Holmes has all the details this morning. Good morning, TJ. Hey, good morning. I attended a concert. Can you believe it? And I'm still in my concert seat. Yes, this was a concert like we've never seen before, where the entire audience watched from their living rooms and all the artists. Well, they couldn't leave their living rooms either. Don't let the sun go down on me. Elton John had to make do with an electronic keyboard. This is one of my songs. Mariah Carey had to conference in her backup singers. And Tim McGraw sang from his diving board. She had a song, tan line, and red lipstick. I worked so hard for that first kiss. And I walk a lonely road. The biggest names in entertainment had to wing it in isolation, but came together for the iHeartRadio Living Room Concert for America on Fox. Thank you so much to all the incredible, brave nurses and doctors out there working so hard every day. I hope this makes you feel better. It's music is making me feel a lot better right now. The night paid tribute to those on the front lines fighting the spread of COVID-19. Really we know that your concerns are a mile high and we hope this bit of entertainment can feed and fuel your soul. Elton John was joined for laid back living room performances by Billie Eilish. So you're a tough guy, like a really rough guy. Alicia Keys. A first responder who is risking a life to give us a love and get it right on time. And the Backstreet Boys. Others like Demi Lovato made special appearances, encouraging viewers to donate to charitable organizations. Like a skyscraper. And again, just a sign of the times here. This is what we're going to have to do. But Stray, like you mentioned, a million dollars raised. They announced that 20 minutes into the benefit concert and the benefit the money goes to uh, Feeding America and also the First Responders Children's Foundation. So an interesting night, first of its kind, but uh, it's just a sign of the times, Stray. Oh, Robin, I'm tossing back to you, Robin. Hey, from home. It's good to see you there, Robin. <laughs> That's all right. <laughs> it's good to, always good to see you there, TJ, looking well. We want to show folks also something that was really beautiful. Take a look at this photo. That is a plane full of health care workers on their way from Atlanta on a Southwest flight heading to New York City. They're going to help hospitals that are overwhelmed by the coronavirus outbreak. They expect to stay for around six weeks, but what a beautiful sight to see them looking so happy and knowing what they're going to be doing here. And a, a special shout out, someone asked me to uh, respiratory therapists, they're not getting enough love. They said respiratory therapists, they're on the front lines as well. So, but it's just great to see people coming together. Southwest providing that kind of transportation to New York. Boy, it sure is. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.